Hi, uh, hello everybody, it's William, welcome to my channel. So uh, uh, let's continue our journey of, of pixel art. So um, previously, yeah, I share how I made uh, my pixel brush uh, and uh, you can uh, add a new layer and draw like this. Okay, and um, uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a canvas. So um, 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 welcome to my channel if you stumble upon my channel. Uh, this channel is all about my journey of learning digital art. I really love art and um, I'm definitely not a professional. Uh, this is like a, my long-term uh, wishes. And uh, right now I got unemployed, so I get all the time in the world. So um, uh, I, I want to pick it up and uh, continue my journey of learning. So this channel is uh, like a sharing of experience of my, um, my, my journey of digital art. And um, so, the best way to support me and keep this channel alive and actually keep me alive is, uh, is to subscribe for you to subscribe to the channel because uh, right now I'm employed uh, I got no uh, positive uh, cash flow um, so um, yeah um, your support is really, really crucial for me to reach the monetization goal, uh, monetization goal and uh, start to uh, become a YouTube partner okay thank you so much for support and uh, in this video I'm going to show you guys how to make the canvas so canvas like this is really simple we're going to use the progress um, um, uh, uh, guide drawing guide and uh, we're going to customize drawing guide okay let me just uh, um, create a new uh, screen size for it so um, you can uh, yeah, once you do that you can you, you can you can save it okay and uh, say you can uh, go to the width of um, and um, here is my just my opinion. Uh, I think in the pixel art, the beauty of pixel art is that uh, the more advanced that you want to get, the the, the smaller the size uh, of the the, the 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 canvas size is. So um, if you say want to draw realistically, you're going to uh, get a really really big uh, size like width and height like that. But uh, the pixel brush won't. Um, yeah, won't have a huge effect. It will just be a real thin line. So if you are use a normal canvas, like this really big canvas, even though I use our, our pixel brush, you don't see a really big uh, pixelated effect. That's because uh, even though you got this pixelated um, brush, still, um, if you shrink it too much, it will just be a line. Okay. So the best thing for me, uh, uh, for us to do, is to shrink. The whole size down a bit. So what I'm going to do is to make a new um, width and height, and I'm going to go with the 16 by 16 because uh, of course you, you can say 1550. Um, that will be a huge canvas um, in Pixar's point of view. Okay, so DPI you don't need to worry about that too much. You just need to change the width and height. Okay, and uh, we got a really big canvas, and you guys can see. Um, uh, if you draw uh, your pixel, uh, you draw on the canvas using your pixel brush, you can actually uh, see the pixelated effect. But uh, um, uh, I like it sort of like the uh, drawing guide effect. So what I'm going to do is to uh, adding a uh, drawing assistant or canvas, and we can uh, um, can get we can get animation assistance. So we get we are here, so we can get a reference. But uh, that's. Uh, for another video uh, that's specified for animation right now let's just uh, use the uh, drawing guide i think that uh, will be enough okay and uh, once you uh, click that you can get this pixelated effect and um, if you did not give this effect like this you can edit the drawing guide okay right now the default is two pixel i'm going to make it just one pixel so we've got a really really small pixelated um uh, yeah the feeling and um, then let me choose down so when you actually draw on it you just draw a pixel at a time okay depending on the uh, on the strength of course so if you got a really hard strength on it you might get four pixel you got a really small nice touch you just get one pixel something like that okay and um, uh, of course you can change the uh, the, 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 the size uh, but it won't affect too much because you already adjust the setting and of course you can change your opacity uh, We do have effect on opacity uh, for the uh, for the brush that we just create um, 
so yeah do use this opacity as well as this every pixel uh, really really carefully um the thing i learned about uh, creating pixel art is that um, uh, because the pixel art is so small that every pixel counts uh, so every pixel um, right here exists for a reason uh, rather than just just uh, like you, you just draw like this you carelessly drop say one pixel here uh, in pixel art uh, it, this thing does not happen Okay, the, the pixel artists did not um, just uh, are careless to drop one pixel, but rather one pixel means so much. So much. And um, so um, I think this is really huge canvas uh, in pixel art point of view. Uh, so for example, um, if you are say uh, drawing or designing a sprite, um, you might just, uh, just to change the size to a really, really small one. So maybe just a 16 by 16, okay? And if you, you click down, you get a really small size canvas and we can get drawing assistant and add that. If you would draw that to just a one pixel and when you click down, you can't draw that carelessly because the, if you draw that carelessly, uh, you won't have so much pixel to work with. So for example, if you want to draw an eye, uh, like a like a there's a you know, like the uh, oh, sorry like if you want to draw a say bouncing um, um like an enemy okay you want to draw eye and uh, you won't be able to draw that carelessly and still have a like the the the, the, the eye area you draw the outline and sometimes it's just totally black okay so you you have to design every pixel very very carefully so if i just draw something like this you might just uh, kind of have an overflow effect then you have to yeah just uh, just erase that so if you want to erase that the the uh, uh, erasing uh, can't be just a solid brush or something like that you got to use the new pixel brush that you just created and then you erase that pixel by pixel so that's what i mean that every pixel comes so if you just change a little bit of the pixel you got a completely different feeling to it okay so um that's um that's that's the beauty of a pixel art and um, i'm intrigued by it uh especially i got a, i also got another channel where uh, i where i share my journey of, uh, of game development so um, I used the pixel arts and the uh, anime that I made assets and import that to my project. It's a, it's a great fun. Okay, so like yeah, I would draw a smiley face and uh, maybe add uh, something like that. This is just a uh, sixteen by sixteen, and of course you, you want uh, more detail. You can uh, you can go to uh, say crop and resize, and we got this uh, thirty two by thirty two, and uh, once you change that. You can get a great detail um, of your sprites or whatever or assets that you want to draw, uh, but I think um, the most uh, like the um, uh, beginner friendly uh, and um, also you can add a, a relatively good amount of detail is sixteen by sixteen. Okay, sixteen by sixteen. Um, if you go up to this big, um, yeah, you, you kind of just mix the. Um, the boundary between the pixel art as well as the some realistic or cartoonish uh, uh, art. So um, yeah, that's my uh, yeah my yeah because that's what I learned recently. So um, yeah, hope you guys uh, um, enjoy it and uh, yeah, please subscribe to my uh, uh, journey of art, pursuing your art, and give this video a thumb up. And most importantly, right now I need to earn money okay so please please subscribe so i can reach the monetization goal and thank you so much for your support i will see you next video bye